in my college speech class, my professor had mentioned that um, a student had previously done it for their final. And instead of actually doing a presentation, they went up and did stand-up comedy. And I'd always loved watching stand-up comedy. Like, I'd watched it on TV every day, Comedy Central, all day, every day, when it, since I was a kid. I'd never thought of actually trying it until then. And so I did it, I signed up, and I did it at the Palm Beach Improv, which is a fairly big room, and I did it for my speech final, and it went pretty well, except for uh, they told you to bring as many people as possible, which I thought meant bring every single person I know, which I didn't realize until about five minutes before the show that if I bombed, it would be in front of every single person I know. So it's a room of 300 people, and half of which are my close family and friends. And I just panic. But thankfully, uh, because it was half close family and friends, it went pretty well. The room was on my side. <laughs>
Patrice O'Neill. I always loved him on the roast. Um, Chelsea Peretti, just to be in the same room as her. Uh, Joan Rivers, I feel like she would eviscerate me. Uh, I like her. And fifth. like a uh, Louis C.K. just to have him back. I am actually opening a comedy and arts cafe in Jacksonville. So I am hoping to kind of be a part of the comedy scene there and be a place to kind of grow it and be a venue that can have these more like unique and creative shows that and kind of bring us up to a level where like you go to Jacksonville and you know you can find a great comedy show like the same way you can go to Chicago for great improv or New York for great stand-up. And I don't know if we'll get to that level in five years, but if we can get close, I would love it. I've actually over the last year been branching out into improv and I love it and then in the past few months I've gotten into sketch comedy and I think uh, that might be kind of my wheelhouse because I feel like it's a happy medium between the kind of uh, more performance and character aspects of improv but with the same kind of uh, joke writing and thought that goes into stand-up and I've, I like that kind of connection. My uh, Twitter is at Becky Marola, and uh, I am on Instagram as the Very Bex. And then they can go to my comedy and arts cafe website is judajax.com, which is uh, J E U X D E J A X. I would like them. I think overall. Uh, you go out to a comedy show to have a good time. So if I can make you laugh and have a good night and just be a little bit happier and not think about bad things for the night and just even if you can laugh at my misery and the terrible stories I tell, um, I think it'll kind of lift you up a bit. So if I can kind of do that for people. Hi, I am Becky Marks, the best white female Jewish rapper in Jacksonville, Florida, as well as a stand-up, sketch, and improv comedian. Uh, check out my interview on cutiepie.com.